Lightning can cause serious structural damage to tall buildings such as churches. And if a bolt strikes a building, you need to be aware of both internal and external effects that it might have. Structural damage to the fabric of the church is often minor, but it can result in fires and falling masonry, damaging the building and posing risk to passers-by. Indirect damage is likely to happen to electrical systems and equipment, with the voltage surge causing malfunctions and shutdowns, as well as burnt-out wiring. It makes you realise that indirect damage can be just as serious when you find out that 6 out of 10 insurance claims for lightning damage offer electrical wiring and equipment, as opposed to structural damage. There is no way to predict exactly when lightning is going to strike, and the traditional method of protection that most churches use is a lightning conductor, which we would recommend having fitted if a risk assessment indicates that one may be required. Churches should also consider installing surge protection to care for the electrics within the building. We offer advice on lightning damage and lightning conductors on our website. For further information, please visit the Risk Planner on the Ecclesiastical Church Matters website or call your local insurance consultant and surveyor. Mm -hmm.